Hi everyone, it's Paperworm, and I'm back with another flip through. Uh, the other one will probably come after my Halloween challenge on Halloween day. Yeah, <laughs> so I thought it was a good idea to uh, show you the first half of this journal because I'm almost halfway through, I think. Uh, the page number, I don't know, the page number is completely different from what is um, written in the article. Uh, on the page where you buy it so i'm not even completely sure where the middle is but whatever this is journal number 53 it is a, a killed star journal okay if you want to buy it then you have to go to this online shop named killed star yeah because some people were asking me even though it says right on top where it comes from you know so <laughs> no you know um this is the inside. This is just uh, some lyrics uh, by Throw the Fight. It's just a random song I discovered on YouTube and it really spoke to me. Oh. <laughs> a picture of Eric Draven from the TV series The Crow. Here I just, you know, every time I wash my hair, I lose this much of hair. Like basically a whole strand. So I just. I kind of felt like keeping, you know, but uh, I made it look like a little bit witchy, you know, <laughs> you know, for hair for like, you know, dark arts and stuff, uh, whatever, so, <clears throat> I bought some Stephen King books and I did this one to be exact, <laughs> so, Revival. I did start to read it yet, uh, but I didn't come far yet. It was Friday 13th. Some coffee that I had, hazelnut cream. I got this a patch from Brit. So I put a picture of it in here. Because it really speaks to me. <laughs> I was finally watching the first movie of it because I planned to go to the cinema afterwards, but in the end I didn't go. The book was, of course, as always, so much better. <laughs> it was probably one of my favorite books now. Oh yeah, so on this day um, I had beef with my, um, you know, the woman who was caring for my case in the welfare center. And uh, I was fighting with her so hard on the phone. And I was so upset that she thought I was about to kill myself. And so she did send over police and firefighters and ambulances. And they all showed up to my house and I didn't know <laughs> what was going on. And I had to explain to them them officers that uh i was not doing that you know <laughs> but it was funny it was funny but weird i felt a little bit embarrassed you know i mean i didn't even say much i i just said something like along the lines you know then i could just jump outside the window or something like that you know and uh well she took this a little bit too serious but I was re I was just upset. I was just furious. Uh, yeah, this looks like an X-ray. <laughs> I'm using some things that I was sent to last year. Um, who was it actually? I don't know. Wait, wait a second. I I need to. I have the feeling I need to. To say from who it came from like I got a lot of things and I'm pretty sure it says in this card where I got this from Vicky Lanigan is her name yeah <laughs> right so she did send me a lot of stuff um, last year it, it, I think it arrived after Halloween and so I couldn't use it anymore but uh, 
yeah i use it this year <laughs> i use all of your stuff eventually when the time comes a postcard from trish she did send me some halloween goodies too and some really really nice uh, star and alien themed things and that's my favorite wine i um i tried to remove this label from the bottle with steam but the steam made it go all weird it's not as deep red as it was before some coffee i brought from belgium i'm drinking it right now it's actually not bad at all it's really strong though Yeah, I was uh, thinking, you know, this journal is not easy to decorate because of its shape. You know, I was thinking about how to decorate it. And I found some nice ways, but I'm also kind of happy when this is over. Because it doesn't, doesn't offer me much space. And using this as the Halloween challenge journal is was not a good idea. Because it does just not offer enough space. I need, you know, I wish now I had a square notebook. Kind of regret it a little, but <laughs> what, what can I do? What can I do? It's too late. This is just a prayer for your home. Like, I saw some um, paranormal investigators uh, saying this after investigating a haunted doll. And then everything went nuts, you know. Things were falling in this woman's house and stuff. So she said this prayer afterwards. It starts like this. God, bless every corner of this house. May peace dwell within. Protect all that come and go, whether friend or kin. It's, it's really nice. Really nice. I mean, I'm not in particular into like anything religious, but you know I like prayers and stuff. So I really like that. Why not? This was actually from yesterday, but I didn't finish. Maybe I just... I finish now. Okay, let me finish it. Perfect. <laughs> so, today is the 1st of October, and um, we are starting uh, the Halloween journal challenge uh, called Paper Halloween. 2k19 so mm. of course i printed this out i put this into my journal and you you find this on my uh, on my instagram or if you see someone else posting just tap on on this little hashtag uh, paper halloween 2k19 and then you go into this folder where everything is uh, collected <clears throat> so I got this really pretty washi tape. I don't know if you can see it, but it has some kind of shine, like some kind of gold. Really pretty. Well, I think that's it for now. The next flip through will come uh, eventually. Look, I look, I could not even put in a proper envelope. I had to cut it and then re-glue it in order for it to make it, you know, to close. It as a I don't know. I'm really not a big fan of the shape. I mean, it it's cool and everything, you know, it's like really like gothy and edgy, you know, but it's not convenient. I must say this. <laughs> it's not convenient, but it was on sale at the Kill Store, the Kids Kill Star store and um I got it for just 4 4 euros, I think. So yeah, I don't I I don't regret it. Anyway, Peace out.